Hey, Misuzu. Haruto's sitting in your seat, huh? Shh, what if someone hears? It's just a coincidence because it's an elective class. No need to be shy. You like Haruto, right? Shh. I feel like someone's watching me. I need to focus on my fan letter to Mizuzu-chan, my favorite idol. At the last live show, you shined brighter than anyone else. I'm Haruto Toyama, a high school junior. I'm a hopeless guy who writes fan letters to my favorite idol during class. But my specs are pretty high. If I lift my messy bangs, my face is decent looking, and I'm reasonably good at both studying and sports. Okay, next question. Haruto. Haruto. Haruto! Y yes Stop daydreaming. You'll fail the next test. Yes, I'll be more careful. That was close. And after that, the class ended without any issues. <sighs> I can feel Haruto's warmth. He was sitting here, right? It's already after school. There's no way you can still feel his warmth. And if he saw you like this, he'd be creeped out. It's fine. He already went home. And he's so nice, he wouldn't be put off by something like this. But why Haruto? <laughs> you wouldn't understand, Katone. I'm Misuzu Funaki. Actually, I'm in love with my classmate Haruto Toyama. I stand out because I have blonde hair and a loose school uniform, and I have a pretty face that makes me popular with the opposite sex. I like modest and reserved people. Also, those who don't just approach me for my looks. But aren't there better looking guys? Haruto is handsome! I saw it myself, you know. During P.E., when he lifted his bangs and wiped the sweat from his forehead, he was actually super cool. Alright, alright. I'll listen to your love story at the family restaurant. Let's go. Then I have to get ready to leave. Huh? What's wrong? There's something like an envelope in my desk. What? A love letter? To me? The sender was Haruto, whom I have a crush on. At that time, I was... It's not here. It's not here! Weird. Mizuzu-chan's fan letter is missing. I wrote it during the elective class, but... I remembered that I had left the fan letter in a desk that wasn't mine, and decided to go back to school. When I opened the door, there were my classmates Mizusu Funaki and Kotane Hayashi, who I never really interacted with. Yo! I'm here too. Uh, what's going on? And how do you know where I live? This. I found it in my desk, so I brought it to you. Uh, um, thank you. I sat at your desk during the elective class and forgot to take it with me. This is a fan letter for an idol. Why are you blushing? Well, it's embarrassing to have a classmate see your fan letter, right? You don't have to be embarrassed or try to hide it, you know? Just be a man and own up to it. Huh? There's only one Misuzu with such an old-fashioned name in our school. Me. This is definitely a love letter for me, right? What? It's true that my favorite idol and Misuzu have the same name, but this is genuinely a love letter for the idol Misuzu-chan. You don't have to be shy. My answer to your confession is okay. What? So, um... <sighs> you're my boyfriend. No, wait. Please listen to me till the end. Miss Suzu has a delicate side to her, you know. Take good care of her. Best regards from her best friend, too. See you at school tomorrow. Uh, this can't be happening. Suddenly, my classmate who came to my house has become my girlfriend. Uh, uh, I'm so shocked that the Haruto I like is a fan of the idol Misuzu. It can't be helped. He doesn't know that you were the idol Misuzu. I forced myself into a relationship with Haruto out of jealousy of the idol Misuzu, but now I feel terrible about myself. If he finds out that I'm Misuzu, he'll probably be repulsed, right? But all I want is a normal romantic relationship. I thought I wouldn't date anyone unless they saw me for who I am, without the title of an idol. But I don't want to lose Haruto to Misuzu. It's a strange situation, isn't it? Both of them are you, after all. How can I explain that the letter was meant for the idol Mizusu so she understands? I never thought my first experience with dating would turn out like this. No, this isn't dating. I won't accept it. Good morning. 
Uh, yeah. About yesterday. W what are you doing? You really are cool. Huh? Here. What? We're a couple, so let's at least hold hands. No, this is school, you know? Besides, I don't accept our relationship. Hurry up! Uh, that's a bit pushy. I tried to clear up the misunderstanding afterward, but my efforts were in vain. The news of our relationship spread throughout the school. This is impossible! For now, I decided to go with the flow. After school, I ended up being with Mizusu again. We'll be there soon. Where are we going? Karaoke? Darts? Or could it be... Natsumi! <gasps> a kid? This is a daycare, right? She's my little sister. I see. Hey, hey! Is this guy your boyfriend, Big Sis? That's right. Wait a minute, I haven't... Natsumi, this is Haruto. Haruto? That's a cute name. Hey, let's play at my house. Huh? Your house? Going to your house all of a sudden is a bit... We've only just met, after all. It's rare for Natsumi to get attached to someone like this. She's usually very cautious. Come on, come on, let's play! Do you hate me? By the way, Natsumi tends to cry easily. <sighs> Alright, now go to your house. Yay! It seems like she's trying to make me her real boyfriend by starting from the outside. And just like that, we were sitting around the dining table as if we were a family. It's so delicious when we all eat together. Misusu, you're really good at cooking. Since we're a single parent family, my mom works late, so I usually take care of the housework. I see. But when I have work, my grandma comes to help. Work? You mean a part-time job? W well, something like that. Wow, that's tough. By the way, what kind of job do you have? Well, something in customer service, I guess? You know, sitting around the table like this, we look like a married couple. We sure do. Huh? You're not denying it. Maybe this means you're gradually opening up to me. I'm so happy. Uh, well, that's... I wonder why. Even though our relationship started from a misunderstanding, Maybe I can get along with Mizuzu after all. My impression of Mizuzu changed significantly when I thought about her going to school every day, taking care of Natsumi, doing housework, and working part-time. People aren't just what they appear to be. Mizuzu said she would do the dishes, so I ended up playing hide-and-seek with Natsumi. Huh? Where did Natsumi go? Is she in this room? Crap, this is definitely Mizuzu's room! What? Why are these here? Why are Mizuzu's fan letters here? And they all seem to have different handwriting. Could it be that Mizuzu is actually... Haruto! Where are you? I made coffee! I hurriedly left the room and left Mizuzu's house, saying it was getting late. Is Mizuzu my favorite idol after all? Could it be that she's working as a manager part-time? But it's strange that they have the same name. Now that I think about it, their voices and faces seem similar, too. How long can I keep deceiving Haruto? That night, I came up with a plan. The next morning, I went to school with Mizuzu as if nothing had happened. Mizuzu, do you have any other sisters besides Natsumi? Nope. So the sibling theory is debunked. Could it really be that Mizuzu is Mizuzu? Hey, are you free after school today? If you are, do you want to go to karaoke together? Let's go! It's rare for you to invite me, Haruto, but I'm tone deaf, so it's embarrassing. I'm bad at singing too, so don't worry about it. I just feel like making some noise. We've had a lot of assignments to turn in recently, right? I want to let off some steam. So, see you after school. Okay. And so, after school, Mizuzu showed me her tone deafness. But even I, who am dense, could tell this is an act. So what's next? All right, my turn. I really love a solo song by an idol named Mizuzu. I is that so? It's my first time hearing that. 
I remember that during a live performance, Mizuzu said she would unconsciously dance when her songs played in public. And now, as the music starts, her feet under the table begin to dance a small dance. I'm starting to think that Mizuzu really is Mizuzu. Hey, Mizuzu, can I ask you something? I want you to close your eyes. Why? You're acting a bit weird today, Haruto. Just do it, please. Okay, okay. I'm going to be kissed by Haruto. I'm so happy. <sighs> His face is getting closer. My first kiss is about to happen. Huh? Weren't you going to kiss me? I knew it! You're the idol Mizuzu! Uh, you found out! I knew it would come to this. I'm the idol Misuzu. I'm sorry I deceived you. It's understandable that you had to hide your identity. If people found out, the whole school would go crazy. The reason I was hiding my identity wasn't just that. I wanted people to interact with me as Misuzu Fanaki, not as an idol. I disappointed you by being Misuzu, right? On the contrary, I'm happy. My favorite idol was in the same class as me. So you're happy because I'm the idol Misuzu, right? Well, to be honest, at first that was the case. But now, I'm glad that I had a chance to get to know Mizuzu Funaki, a girl who I never would have crossed paths with otherwise. I learned about a side of her I didn't know. I used to have a prejudice against Gyaru. But there's one thing I don't understand. If you're Mizuzu who receives fan letters all the time, why did you mistake the fan letter I left in your desk for a love letter? I knew it was a fan letter from Misuzu, but Misuzu Funaki pretended to mistake it for a love letter. I've liked you, Haruto, for a long time. Misuzu. When I found out you were a fan of Misuzu, I had mixed feelings. That's why I pretended to misunderstand, so that I could be by your side as a normal girl, not an idol. I'm sorry for deceiving you. Then our relationship ends today. I guess so. It's impossible now, isn't it? I feel it's like I've been forcing you to be with me while ignoring your feelings. Can you show me your face one last time? Like this? But it's not the end. Let's actually be together. I like you too, Mizuzu. Huh? It's true that at first I was put off by how forceful you were. But as I went with the flow and spent time with you, I became attracted to your hardworking nature. The idol Mizuzu, the ordinary high school student Mizuzu, and the Mizuzu who tries her best for her family. All of them are very charming. It's more than enough reason to be together, right? So, let's stop making those gloomy faces. Okay, I got it. I'm genuinely your girlfriend now. I'm so happy. Hey, Haruto. Close your eyes. You're not planning to put a wig on me, are you? No, I'm not. Jeez, you ruined the mood. Uh, sorry, sorry. Our first kiss was postponed yet again. Later, I went to Mizuzu's handshake event with her best friend, Kotane. Mizuzu looks cuter than ever today. You think so too, right, Aruto? Yeah, she's really cute. Don't make me blush too much. There are other people here too. I'll support you more than anyone else. Please take care of me from now on. Our youth, which was never supposed to intersect, is just beginning now. <laughs>